हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई विल सॉल्व वन इंटरेस्टिंग कोडिंग इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन बेस्ड ऑन स्टैक द प्रॉब्लम इज लाइक दिस राइट अ प्रोग्राम टू सॉर्ट अ स्टैक सच दैट द स्मॉलेस्ट एलिमेंट्स आर ऑन द टॉप यू कैन यूज एन एडिशनल टेम्परेटी स्टैक बट यू मे नॉट कॉपी द एलिमेंट इन टू एनी अदर डेटा स्ट्रक्चर्स सच एज एन एरे द स्टैक सपोर्ट्स फॉलोइंग ऑपरेशन पुश pop peak and is empty so before going to the solution it's my suggestion to pause the video and try yourself and then watch the solution now let's start solving it one approach can be to implement sorting algorithm where we will search entire stack s1 to find the minimum element and push it onto the new stack s2 so the first minimum element which will be pushed will be 1 then the it will be repeated again and the next element will be pushed which is 4 and this process will continue this approach will actually require three step the first one is the original stack s1 the second one will be the final stack which is the sorted stack that will be s2 and the third stack will be stack s3 which will act as a buffer during our searching of minimum element from stack s1 to search for the minimum element from stack s1 we need to pop elements from s1 and push it onto stack s3 Un- unfortunately this approach will require two additional stacks but we only have one stack to use so let's see next approach in our second approach we will pop each element from stack s1 and if it's a greater than the top element of stack s2 then we will push that into the stack s2 but if the element is lesser than the top element of the stack s2 then we will pop the top element of the stack s2 and push it into the stack s1 and then we will push the taken element into the stack s2 so let's see this example firstly we will take 9 and then since the stack s2 is empty then we can directly push 9 into that stack then we will take 1 since 1 is lesser than 9 so we will push 9 into stack s1 and and then we will push 1 into stack s2 now we will take 9 which is there which is the top element of stack s1 now 9 is greater than 1 so we will directly push into the stack s2 now we will take another element which is stack which is from stack s1 which is 7 now 7 is lesser than 9 so 9 we will push from stack s2 to stack s1 and then 7 will be pushed to stack s2 now we will take 9 again and then 9 will be pushed directly to stack s2 as it's greater than 7 now we will take 4 as 4 is lesser than 9 and also it's lesser than 7 so we will pop 9 and 7 from stack s2 and push it into stack s1 and finally we will push 4 into the stack now we will take 7 
and since 7 is great, greater than 4 then we can push into the stack now we will take 9 and 9 we can see that 9 is all uh, is greater than 7 so we can push into the stack so final stack will be looking like this and now we will pop each element from stack s2 and push each element to stack s1 the resultant stack will look like this we will have 9 at bottom then 7 then 4 and at the top 1 So this particular algorithm will take order of n square time complexity and order of n space complexity. If we were allowed to use unlimited stacks, we would implement a modified quick sort or merge sort. With the merge sort solution, we would create two extra stacks and divide the stack into two parts we will uh, recursively sort each stack and then merge them back together in sorted order into the original stack note that this will require the creation of two additional stacks per level of recursion with the quick sort solution we will create two additional stacks and divide the stack into two stacks based on a pivot point the two stacks will be recursively sorted and then merged back together into the original stack just like the earlier solution this one involved creating two additional stacks per level of recursion now we will see the implementation of approach 2 Shh. <laughs>